Those who estimate who can be in silence. Those who estimate the ones who choose to be in silence. Wisdom can be high. Wisdom can be behind. Guiding their steps. Telling them how to run life. So don't subestimate the one who chose to be in silence. Don't. Hi. Here, Blessing Torch. I'm going to speak a little bit, just a tiny bit, based on James 3. Verse 2 says, we all fail in many areas, but especially with our words, our words. Yet, if we are able to bridle the words we say, we are powerful enough. Hear that? Do you get that part? We are powerful enough to control ourselves in every way. No one, in every way. And that means our character is mature and fully developed. And then we go down to number nine. And it said, we use our thumb to praise God, our Father, and, and then turn around and curse a person who was made in his very image. No, no, no. Out of the same mouth, we pour out words of praise one minute and curse the next. My brothers and sisters, this should never be. Will you look for olive hanging on a feed tree? Or you pick up feeds from a grapevine? It is possible that fresh and bitter water can flow out of the same spring. No, right? So neither can a bitter spring produce fresh water. 13. If you consider yourself to be wise and one who understand the ways of God advertise it with a beautiful, beautiful life guided by wisdom, gentleness. Never brag or boast about what you have done and you will prove that you are truly wise. Dang it. <laughs> Like many of these youth generation, we said, let me say it again for all of us. So it's fresh in our soul, in our mind, in our hearts. Never brag or boast about what you have done. And you will prove that you are truly wise. But if there is a bit of jealousy, our competition hiding in your heart, then don't deny it and try to compensate for it by boasting and being funny. For that has nothing to do with God's heavenly wisdom. Hear you? Who have hear, who have ear, may hear the word of God. For that has nothing to do with God's heavenly wisdom, but can best be described as the wisdom of this word, both selfish and devilish. So wherever jealousy and selfishness are uncovered, you will also find many troubles and very kind of meanness. I'm sorry, it's very hot. And 
and my air condition well our air condition is decided to stop today so 17 but the wisdom from above is always pure feel with peace it will give you peace and for that reason you will be able to spread out peace it's not it's not coming from the goodness of most high heavens and God so delete it throw it away take it out don't abide on it just remove it and start thinking for the best and the best thing so again for the wisdom from above is always pure feel with peace considerate and teachable it is filled with love and never displays prejudice or hypocrisy in any form and it always bird birds the beautiful harvest of righteousness. Good seeds of wisdom, fruit will be planted will, with peaceful acts. You get that part? Good seeds of wisdom, fruit will be planted with peaceful acts by those who cherish making peace or peacemakers as another translations we say dear ones in the middle of discussion a person who wants to boast and rising voice and you see that the person is constantly pretty much every day constantly trying to make their point be the one who is the winner is a narcissist person is a center self person the same thing in other words and the person that chose to say or to be in silence and allow that person feel that wins by being in silence or choosing silence and walk away or just choosing silence and to shift the atmosphere and to shift the conversations and to shift um, um, the argument for peace. It don't mean that that person is dummy fool and and you can laugh and mock at them because ha 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 you win whatever is the attitude that coming out of the the reactions to it let me tell you something as the beginning don't mistake them many a time it's two reasons that that person is in pain and choose to walk away because cannot handle anymore uh, the relationship due to pain and traumas that are not solved yet by God. And the other side, it could be that that person knows the wisdom of God, have it heard it, have it read about it, have it meditated on it, and knows that it's better to allow God to be the one who come and bring clearly, clearly statements or clearly words or clearly um, wisdom and knowledge that is above what the person may expose or want to expose or, or wants to make value. Um, and like sometimes they they express and they move like it's kind of a statement because it's what they say it's what they know it's what they believe and they want the the, the ones with their 
uh, expressing, with whom they're expressing their um, point of view, point of belief, to accept what they say and, and walk with it. Um, and dear ones, because they know that being silent is to be perfect before God, they choose to fear God and to allow the circumstances to smooth or to, to be in peace because it's, for them it's more important the relationship than having the right. And that, that very action is wisdom. Chosen to have peace with the person above having the right, that's wisdom. That's being perfect before God's eyes. That's a peacemaker moving in actions. So don't mistake them. You can be wrong. Don't mistake the sons and the daughters of God. You can be wrong. And learn. Learn to be humble in the wisdom of God. God most high, always, always, we flow with his wisdom in the empowerment of peace or joy. But mainly, peace and his love is all around. It's all that is conquering and, and winning and, and taking over. All yourself inside and out. If that's not what you're feeling, even even if it's something unknown that we had never heard, let me tell you, when he comes in with those things, he prepares our hearts to receive that seed. And he prepared our hearts in such a way that we are in peace. And when we really receive that encounter with that revelation that coming with God, with his understanding, we can comprehend or we can find um, peace to wait until we comprehend. Because we know that in due time, he will remove the curtains and, and he will say, here, here I am with your answer or waiting. Passionately. So choose as a James 3 highlights to use your thumb wisely with a peaceful wisdom of God. That's that's very that very action is what praises him. That very action is what spread good aroma before his presence. That very action is what make you more closer one with the great I am. The God of all. The God that is, that can be inside of us through the spirit. So I bless you. I bless your heart. I bless your mind. I bless your emotions. I bless your ears. I bless your eyes. I bless your walk. That we be one full of wisdom and peace and love. See you then to the next one. God bless you. Shalom.